Well, a very good evening to you on what is pretty close to an ideal evening for football. There is a barely a cloud evident. The world and his wife have gone to great lengths to be here for a match of great consequence and massive interest in these parts. Barely a breath of wind, so the football has no excuses for not being at its very best. The teams I know are pumped for this. They are fantastic scenes in the stands. There is a great sense of drama here, a great sense of their excitement and expectation. Here's a venue this which simply adds to the spectacle of the game in stages. One of the most impressive arenas in this part of the world. To what we've been told, this is how it looks. It's a 4-3-3. Yeah, and the two wide players up front can make the system pretty much succeed or fail. They'll be quite flexible in their creative movement. They like to drift in. At times, they'll mix their game up and, and keep their width. And, of course, they're also expected to track any runs from opposition fullbacks. So they've got quite hard-working jobs. But if they can gain a one-on-one -on -one advantage, they can dictate. Got on the way here pretty promptly. Who do you, Jim, see making a difference here? Well, I'd go for Burak Yilmaz because he takes plenty of boxes. He's aerially strong, he's good on the ball, links up well with the runners around him, and he has a certain amount of dead ball expertise too. There aren't many boxes left here. Yeah, I'm inclined to agree. Gomez. Just brushed off the ball there. Hakimi with good energy in defence as well. Well, they say that your front lads should be that first line of, um, of stopping the opposition, and I think he's taken it to another level with his desire to get back and, and help everyone out. Good challenge, he just stood firm. And now they can launch a counter. Gets away from his opponent. He's put a stop to that. Messi. Goes for goal! goal! It's hardly a surprise, is it? That's what we're here for. A player with this wonderful knack of being able to show up and deliver at important times. Yet, yet another example. That was glorious. Pinpoint accuracy. You know, Peter, from the moment it left his foot, it looked unstoppable. That was thumped. Paris Saint-Germain took the early advantage. Well, they are working very hard to get it wide now, Jim. Yeah, I think they've decided to concentrate on, on working the flanks to help the production line. It's, uh, it's where the room is. It's Yilmaz! He'll hit it! Keeper's not concerned by that. Look, it, it was achievable, Peter, but it needed his best. That's a poor kick by the keeper, he's just given it straight back. Forward it goes. A searching ball out wide. 
Hakimi absolutely focused then on the defensive side of his game. I think it's great to see that kind of application and desire from a forward who wants to help out his defence. I, I think, you know, any good team really, your striker should be the first line of that defence and, and he's delivering. Got a shot away! Oh, that was close. Played it short, played into the middle. Di Maria can get it clear. Oh, that's a waste. Jose Font. Well, it did look promising to start with, but in the end they were thwarted before they could even make it into the final third. Di Maria! chance and a real let off Paris Saint-Germain are looking quite mean on the counter and combating that requires even more meanness Forward quickly. Gomez. And it's got through. Burek Yilmaz. Timely intervention. Danger averted for now. Well, they could break here. Questions were asked. Has a hit! No space, no problem. You just cannot stop him. Oh, this fella's as slippery as a knee the way he freed himself to score. I mean, for that defence, it was a case of now you've got him, now you don't, will you? Saint-Germain have a couple of goals without reply, it's 2-0. We're looking at a very different game now, the command has been established. Mbappe, Gomez, finds himself eased off the ball. Progress he's made on the ball. Where to next? Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Mbappe. Joseph Font simply had to make that count, and he did it with some authority too. Wonderful. Lille get it back again. Plays it out to the wing. Oh, super tackle. They were outnumbered and under the cosh. That had to be spot on, and it was. Gets it back. Di Maria is a definite fell there. Helps available out wide. Hakimi was alert to the possibilities, but in the end it's fruitless. Herrera battles to win it back. What a... Oh, Mbappe! Oh, 
Oh, fine stop from the keeper. Well, as test goal Peter, the keeper just received an A plus grade. half is done, reflections on the first half. Well, it's looking pretty straightforward, Peter. They've got themselves into a, a very good position, so why dither from here when they can repeat their first half success with a, another show of strength? Paris Saint-Germain sitting pretty here at half-time, 2-0 up. Here we go again, then. He's got away. to dink one in. Di Maria comes out on top in a really physical duel. Di Maria who has made his impact already. Gets it back. Gomez. But it's Yilmaz! Wasn't too dissimilar to the previous attempt. Neil really putting a few chances together here. Taking one can only add to such good momentum now. Back into the middle. Mbappe, real chance! Oh, nearly. Really is nothing. A more than decent attempt, Peter. And it's played forward. Gomez spreads it towards the left. And it's messy. Receives it in a good position. Strong challenge, but well within the laws. Burek Yilmaz. He's gone for it! They're actually not getting too tight. He'll have a free kick. Kimpembe tries to clear. And the Herrera. And he's made sure that that won't get through. The fifth one! And more, and more, and more! And the lead is three! It is surely done! Really outwitted one-on-one. 
once more, he gets the better of the keeper. Yeah, he just calmly faced the keeper and waited. It became a, a who blinks first situation. And for me, there was never any doubt as to who was going to come out on top. Paris Saint-Germain take a three-goal lead, and they are romping out of sight. Ball is over the line. Pass needed to be better than that, and he knows it. He was expecting a better ball than that. Now the counter. He could be in here, and the shot! And with the goal at his mercy, a dreadful miss. Paris Saint-Germain just served up a reminder of how good they can be on the break. Their method is clear. Final checks on the touchline, a change about to occur. Well, you have to feel a little for the player been taken off here. I think he's been made the scapegoat after that, but I guess something had to be done. I suppose it did need a little change. Kimpembe goes looking. Oh, good interception. Hoist it forward. Who's getting there? Out to the right. Lovely feet. There are a few waiting for it. This ball, who's going to get there? Goes down, but nothing given. Renato Sanchez. Keira sticks in a foot to win it back. the sort of defending that is going to upset the opposition. It already has, actually. Yeah, and they've finally reacted, but they could have been more switched on before he, he scored. Jose Font. Renato Sanchez. Kimpembe, Di Maria, Vijnaldum, crunching tackle, now it's Burak Yilmaz, Yilmaz tries to get it forward quickly, Keira drives it forward, and a foul, yes the uh, referee's given it, the referee has resisted the temptation to go to his pocket, it's just a stern lecture. Kimpembe, Marquinhos. The referee looks at his watch and blows his whistle. And a great day for attacking football. The artists have painted their pretty pictures. Only one team in it. Any your thoughts on today's game, then, Jim? Yeah, and a result that was true to form. A big team beating a not-so-big team.